So, okay, so you just bought a brand new phone, whether that's an iPhone, whether that's an Android phone or a Windows phone, it doesn't even exist anymore. <laughs> but let's say you just picked up a brand new phone and you're trying to figure out, okay, are my contacts gonna sync from my old phone to my new phone? So what do you do? What are your options? We're gonna talk about that in this video. Let's get into it. Okay, so for this first method, which is the easiest way, we're assuming that you're pretty much going to another iPhone. If this is the case, then what you may not know is your contacts are all synced with iCloud. And if they're not, I'm gonna show you how you can go in there and make sure they are. Okay, so for this first method, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into our settings. You wanna click on your actual Apple ID there. And then from there, you wanna go into iCloud. When you get into iCloud, you're gonna see a whole bunch of options here. Over here, you wanna make sure that the contacts line item right here is selected uh, to be on. Now, when you get a brand new iPhone and you log into your Apple ID with the same iCloud, all your contacts, voila, are gonna be there on your phone. So this is the easiest method. Make sure that it's just synced with iCloud and you're good to go. For the next method, let's say you constantly switch between iPhones and Android devices and you want access to you know all your contacts through Gmail as well. What you can do is when you sign up, make sure you sign up with a Gmail account. Now this will make sure that your contacts are synced across your Gmail as well as your iPhone and all your iCloud accounts. It's probably the easiest way to do it, which will cover you on both bases, whether you're going from an iPhone to another iPhone or whether you're going to another platform. Now the next step that we're gonna talk about is slightly more complicated. Now for this method, basically what we're going to do is we're gonna go onto a computer, we're gonna go on to www.icloud.com. Over here, we're gonna sign into our iCloud account. Once we're there on our iCloud account and we're logged in, we're gonna click on contacts. Once we get in here, you're gonna see all your contacts here. Then we're going to go Command A or Control A if you're on a Windows laptop, which is going to select all your contacts. From this point on, you're gonna see a little gear icon on the bottom left-hand corner. We're gonna click that icon and we're gonna see an option that says Export V-Card. When you click Export V-Card, it's gonna basically create this VCF file that you can download. From here, what we're going to do is we're gonna go into contacts.google.com. Once we get in there, we're gonna see an option saying import. To import contacts, select a CSV or vCard file. And that's what we have. We have a vCard file. So you're gonna select that folder. And then once you import that, then voila. Now this method is probably the most robust because it does give you that VCF file, which you can use to upload into different softwares and different programs. Now the last and final method is probably the most tedious method. However, it also is an option if you'd like. So let's say you wanna just send specific contacts, like one or two contacts. All you gotta do is you open up the contact that you wanna share. There'll be an option from here for you to share contact. Once you hit share contact, it's gonna open up a whole bunch of options. I can airdrop it to like different people. I can, you know, text message it, WhatsApp it, send it through email and whatnot. Uh, I can even copy it to PDF. I can save it to file. So there's tons of options from here. So this works well. If you need to just share one particular contact, then you can do so this way. So for the most part now in 2021, with like the advent of like cloud technology and everything like that, it's a lot easier for you to share your contacts and stuff like that and to care, have it all synced between all your devices. So I hope this video was helpful and beneficial to you guys and you found it informative. If you didn't, please go ahead and give this video a like. And if you like helpful content like this and you want to support us, then please go ahead and sub to this channel. Basically, our mission here is to end global frustration one video at a time. So if you like like that premise then go ahead and give this channel a sub and we will see you guys in the next video thank you for watching take care